Hello folks, welcome back to the Urban Rider Studio. Let's have a look at some summer riding gloves. It is definitely getting hot enough to justify something like this whilst you're on the bike for increased comfort. These are the Merlin Shenstone, and I think Merlin have got it so right with the design of these. If that name is familiar to you, you may be familiar with their jacket of the same name. They've taken some of that style and functionality and obviously transferred it across to these. They're not gonna break the bank either at £49.99, which is a very attractive price point. They're available in either black or brown. It's quite a dark brown, as you can see here with the ones that I'm trying on. And they, of course, have CE approval and they are UKCA certified as well. They use a mixture of fabrics, so you have premium cowhide leather, as you can see through the majority of these. And then you'll see the mesh there on the back for this ventilation to allow that airflow through. The leather on your palm is nice and thick, double layered in certain areas there to make it even more abrasion resistant. You have no padding on your palm, so to speak, but you do have D3O knuckle armor. D3O is a good choice when it comes to knuckle armor. It is much less restrictive. It obviously stiffens under impact, but it is soft and comfortable the rest of the time. They are a short glove. You would want that in the summer as well. And they are Velcro fastened around your wrist. You've got the Merlin logo on your wrist there, as well as the D3O logo. You'll see some perforation on the palm of your hand. As I say, the majority of your airflow is gonna come through this venting at the back through these mesh sections. You've also got perforations around the knuckles and around your wrist. You have this accordion stretch paneling at the back of your hand to make it more flexible. They are nice and flexible, actually. I'm not getting a lot of restriction on there at all. And you've got flexible sections of leather on your fingers also. You have fabric on your thumb and index finger for the use of a touch screen if you need to. And you'll notice the stitching across the fingers is actually found on the outside, which gives it a bit of a unique style look-wise, but it also gives it a bit more comfort on the inside because you won't feel that stitching against your fingers. Often that is one of my big concerns or issues with some gloves, when you can actually feel the stitching against your fingers, more noticeably against your thumb as you're gripping the bars. You don't get any of that on these. You also have a moisture wicking liner on the inside to stop your hands getting sweaty. Very functional then, very stylish and very comfortable. The size that I've got on, if you're wondering, is a large. We've listed that at about an eight and a half, but check our size guide if you're at all unsure. As I say though, there's a decent amount of flexibility in these, so they really are quite comfortable to use. Check them out using the links in the description. I will also drop a link for the Shenstone jacket if you want to check that out as well. Let us know what you think of it in the comments section and we will see you soon for more of the world's finest riding gear. Bye-bye.